All right, welcome back to the Lonza guy. This is Curtis Henry, one of the nuclear affection specialists with Lonza. And again, just kind of doing a quick video here to help our new users of the nuclear effector 4D uh, better understand how to program the nuclear effector. So if you uh, don't know how to set it up, again, I have a video for that that you can check out. But when it is, once it is set up, it is ready to be used. And you can see that this is the home screen here. Then you have your core and you have your X. So uh, when you're ready to use it, you're going to press the X button. And that's going to bring you to the screen where you're going to be able to transfect either the uh, 100 microliter cuvettes or the uh, 16 well 20 microliter strip. So in this case, we're going to actually run through both of these real quick because it's the same setup, but it allows you to see the screen. So we'll start with the cuvettes. So it brings you to this, this screen here where it allows you to uh, start programming all the cuvettes that you want to run. So it allows you to run uh, multiple cuvettes at a single time or program it at a single time and then allows you to run them. So in the case here, we're going to program A1 and A2 because we're going to do two samples. Uh, and this gives you an opportunity that there's a couple options. One, you can select the cell program. And this is going to give you a list of programs that Lonza has optimized in our R&D department. Uh, so you can actually scroll down to see the different cell types, or you can just hit the little um, mag hourglass, magnifying glass search button, and allows you then to start typing stuff in. So in this case, we're going to do um, Hep G2. So you'll see there's Hep G2 right there, but again, you can select that hit the OK button, and now everything is all programmed. So for that's for HEPD2. Let's say that uh, you have optimized and you've found your own program. Uh, you can check out the video that I'll on my library here that shows you how to program that. But in case you need to program it yourself, you see it uh, something in the uh, peer-reviewed journal that you want to test out for your cell type. And again, how you program that is you select the solution type. Uh, so we'll just select SG, hit OK, and then you and go up here and enter the pulse code. Uh, in this case, we'll, we'll, um, we'll do uh, C, A, we'll come over and press the number, 1, 3, 7. And now those are programmed and ready to go. So that's if you're doing a uh, entering your own information. You hit the OK button. The drawer will open. And I can, as you can see here, I have my two uh, cuvettes where I've got them all set up. The cells are in the uh, nuclear vector solution. I've added my construct and it's ready to go. So I actually put them in there. And you want to put them in there so you can actually read the Lonza. Come back up here and hit start. And it's going to run through the program. And you can see it is now done. Now you can remove these and actually then uh, finish the protocol by adding media and uh, replating them. So that's how we run the cuvette. So we'll go back up and press the home button, which will bring us back to the, uh, the main screen. Again, we'll Press X and we'll go to the strip. So again, the strip, it allows you to program all 16 of these samples. You can run as many as that you want. You can actually program uh, different programs with um, different cell types, or if you're testing different programs uh, to, um, <clears throat> to do an optimization, you can also select, if you choose the program, you can actually see we do have multiple um, uh, optimization panels already programmed. Uh, basically, it's the optimization runs uh, 15 different pulses at different intensities. So you can figure out what's what works best for your cell. In the case here, I've actually set up a strip with uh, doing three samples. And so it's using A1, B1, and C1. Again, you can program any configuration how you want, but that's how this is done. And again, the same thing with, you can do the cell program you can also, another feature, you can tap A to Z, or you can do the last uh, last 10 or the top 10. 
And so if you're running a program regularly, it will be there. In the case here, just for convenience, we'll say we're doing uh, three uh, A, um, four, three ones, hit OK. And now it's all programmed. Again, you can go in and you can freestyle, enter it again if you want to. You can go, again, solution first, SG, and you can enter in your, your pulse code. In this case, we'll just do CA137. We'll hit OK. Now the drawer opens. It does tell you what you're going to be running. And again, now I will put my uh, strip into the device. Make sure it's in there good. And I will hit the start button. The drawer will close. We'll start the process. And then we'll see if this it run through each one of those three samples. And there it is, it's done. The drawer will open, and you can take out your sample and get it ready for plating. So again, that's how you uh, run and program the Nuclear Factor 40. Uh, again, we're the Lonza guys, we're here to help you. Need anything, please let us know. Thank you.